buses hit the streets long before sunrise as Broward County welcomed in the 2011-2012 school year. The first day of school has always been a time of excitement and new opportunities. And this day was no different, as parents and students arrived early to see what this new year will bring. I'm excited because, you know, today is the first day and now he get a chance to go and experience new stuff. He's in a, a better, another grade, higher, fifth grade, and now he get a chance to experience our fifth grade work. To further build on the excitement of the day, for the fifth consecutive year, a Million Father March event was tied into the first day. And according to the National PTA President, Otha Thornton, this parental involvement, particularly from involved fathers, can be vital in the success of a child. Today is the Million Father Mar March down here in uh, Broward County. And uh, this is so important to have fathers and men involved in, in, in their children's lives. In PTA, we're really making a big effort to get men more engaged in, in, in the education of their children. It's so important. And it's just great out here to see so many fathers out here today. Also joining the parents and students on this day was new interim superintendent Donnie Carter. And although these trips are not required for his position, he feels the need to join the schools on this exciting day is an important tradition. And even with all the budget cuts forced on the county and pressures to succeed, he stressed the importance of keeping classrooms fun. I'm very excited, as I should be. Uh, this should be um, an exciting year for students as well as a challenging year. Uh, in my back to school speech, um, I challenged uh, principals, assistant principals, and teachers to have a successful year, but to have fun doing it. The interim superintendent visited four schools, but he wasn't the only school official showing up for the first day as various school board members also toured the schools. They even got to go back to grade school and experience school lunch all over again, enjoying a bite to eat with the students and soaking up this energetic beginning. The kids are excited. Uh, I went to one school and there was only one kindergartner crying. So as a former administrator and teacher, you like that. You like to see the kids happy and walking in the building and excited and confident. I'm looking forward uh, just to everything. I think it's going to be a really great year. We're going to have a new superintendent. I'm looking forward to getting someone great who's going to continue our upward swing in academics, really revamp the district. It's going to be a really amazing year. And that amazing year began on the first day as preparation allowed the schools to start the year off running with instruction right off the bat. It's the, it's the background stuff that people don't see, the weeks and weeks and weeks of preparation that the assistant principals and teachers and the training that we've gone through to prepare great lessons for our kids. Uh, and if, if you can look right now in the hallways. There's no one in the hallway. That's because all the kids are in the classroom right where they're supposed to be. We're here to educate our students so they can compete in the, in the new global economy the 21st century has for us. And by the look of the classrooms, that's exactly what's happening. Broward School Beat can be seen right here on Beacon TV. Invest in yourself.